governments uh, on this issue. Uh, FERPA, Federation Rental Housing, we, this is why we opposed the revisions to the Municipal Act about five or six years ago, because we knew things like this would happen. Is this thing on? I think you got to go really close to your mouth. Pretend that you're going to eat it. Okay, there you go. <laughs> and, um, you know, one thing that, uh, Rob, it's uh, great to hear about uh, MPP Steve Clark uh, talking about this issue with municipal mayors, because the background of this issue is that this was never a landlord-tenant issue. Uh, this was the Ministry of Municipal Affairs and Housing is divided into two branches. One looks after residential tenancies, the other looks after municipal issues. And this was purely an issue related to municipal government. And it was never the government's intention uh, that things like this would happen, where property owners would be responsible for the bills, unpaid bills of tenants. Uh, but unfortunately, that's the situation we're facing today. And the reason why it's so important, because in Ontario, we have a million, one million rental homes that are owned uh, by, and managed just by people like you. And you may not know this, but of that one million, about 320,000 are in single family homes or duplexes or semi detached homes and units of uh, structures of two units or less. And this affects a lot of small landlords. And when we talk, you hear occasionally that there's a you know, shortage of affordable housing. Uh, right now, there's not. There are a lot of Ontario households who have low incomes and have problems paying for housing. But if we keep seeing obstacles like this and issues like this that really make life aggravating for the people who own small rental properties, you are going to start to see a shortage of rental housing in Ontario as people start to sell their properties and decide not to rent them anymore simply because you, you won't be able to do it without going broke. And that's what we don't want and that's why we have to keep pressing ahead and changing issues like this. It's just one of many issues uh, that cause a lot of problems for the rental housing industry. Uh, but we know if we don't resolve issues like this, we are going to see a shortage of affordable rental housing in Ontario. So that's why it's so important. You know, keep pressing on being persistent uh, with this issue.